Good afternoon. My name is Samantha Rauer, and I'm a sta senior staff attorney at Brooklyn Legal Services Corporation A, which is a member of the United for Small Business New York City Coalition. I work on the Commercial Lease Assistance Program, and I'm testifying today to comment on the potential impact of these bills for our clients. You heard earlier from one Brooklyn A client, Akeem Walker, who recently rented out a space for a hair salon in Flatbush, located on the same block where he grew up and lived for 20 years and where he has always dreamed of owning a business. Shortly after signing his lease, as you heard, he learned that there is illegal piping running throughout the building. Upon asking about the issue, his landlord cut off all water supply to his salon and began harassing him with eviction threats. Mr. Walker has already invested roughly $50,000 in building out the space and is now being charged ongoing rent, even though he hasn't been able to open his business without running water. Another of my clients was forced to shut down his dry cleaning business last fall after new ownership took over his mixed use building in Bushwick and issued him a notice to terminate. Uh, my client had operated his business in that same location for 20 years under a month to month agreement with the previous owner which he entered into after moving to Brooklyn from Puerto Rico in the 70s. I spoke with him last Friday and he confirmed that his former space remains vacant. He also told me that most of the residential units in the building are now vacant and that the building is slowly undergoing renovation. All the bills being discussed today would strengthen protections for small business tenants, such as seconds. these Brooklyn A clients, and discourage commercial displacement, in particular intro numbers 1473, 1410, and 1470. Brooklyn A supports these bills, and my written testimony details some additional recommendations, including that building owners submit a written lease in order to be removed from a vacancy registry, and that there be a way for members of the public to report vacancies. On behalf of Brooklyn A, thank you for holding this hearing and for this opportunity to testify. Perfect timing. Thank you.